Jessa Hinton here with TopRank.com with uh, Diego Magdalena. We are sitting here and actually having some conversation before we started the interview. Um, he did not want to stop unwrapping his hands. So here we go. Um, <laughs> we're here in Las Vegas, and this is your hometown. How does it feel to be on the 10th anniversary show for Showbox in your hometown? You know what? It feels really good because uh, there's a little pressure. I want to uh, I want to give the fight to to the, my hometown uh, crowd. You know, they're always there. They're very supportive, and uh, you know, I like to do them a favor as well. Well, they were saying uh, to me earlier that your power is just getting better as you advance, and usually that's not the case for most fighters. Do you owe a lot to Pat Barry? Are you just naturally gifted that way of having more power as you get uh, further along in your career? Uh, you know what? I like to give uh, credit to my Wheaties. I've been eating my Wheaties every morning. So uh, <laughs> on a serious note, no, I, I do like to give credit to my, my coaches, you know, Pat Berry, Augie Sanchez, you know, Michael Fondasev, who's uh, 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 in addition to, you know, my, uh, my coaches now. Um, I think everything's just been, you know, going, uh, going where it's supposed to be going. Um, my, my, my punching power is definitely, uh, um, you know, a scare to everyone out there in my division. All right, your name is becoming well known, and everybody's starting to say that you are in the top ten. I mean, that's that's an honor. You know what? It, it, it's kind of it's motivating to hear that. Um, you know, the top ten. Uh, I always see myself, uh, you know, at at two going for number one, and even the day I become number one, I'm always shooting for more. You know, uh, I want to be that, you know, grounded in that division. Well, talking about your power, you are naturally right-handed. And you switched to southpaw stance. Yes. How does that benefit you in the ring? You know what? It, it does. It throws him off because uh, my power hand is lies up front. But recently, and uh, you know, over the years of training, I've been you know putting a lot of pop into my left hand. So now I have two strong hands to work with. And I see uh, your brothers are here. Actually, your brother. Yep. And then you have another younger brother who's a boxer yes, as well. I do. Uh -huh. Your dad wanted you to be a soccer star. <laughs> you kind of flipped the script and went a different way, but still competitive. Um, how does it feel to be a role model to your brothers, and how does your dad take everything now? You know what? Now, now that my dad's warmed up to the fact that I'm, you know, a boxer, not a, a you know, a soccer star, um, I think it's it's great. You know, he he looks at at me in a, in a way that uh, you know that I can uh, push and motivate my younger brothers as well. Um, they they love to do it. They're right there behind me. They're in the gym with me, and uh, we just feed off each other. Well, thank you for taking the time to meet with me. Uh, Jessa Hinton with TopDrink.com. We wish you the best on Friday. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.